And it's time for Masterpiece of the Week. She said list. So list boring. this. That's how it felt. Hey, Reggie. Go soccer, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, absolutely. I just loved it. Mike, I, I'm so happy you took a day off because, like, it's clear that you're energized so much so yeah. that Kevin was ready to start Masterpiece of the Week about three minutes ago. Mm. Mike was like, I got stuff to talk what? about. What? How dare you? Sorry. That's fair. No, but it was good stuff. I was enjoying it. You know, it. I have to remember sometimes, GVAC has a five-hour show. Do they care if our Friday crosstalk is three minutes long? They'll they live. do not. They will live. Um, I don't know. I don't have a segue. Oh, okay. but I should probably start the segment. Masterpiece of the Week is a, show, a segment that we do every week in which we revisit some of the funny, stupid, odd things that have been said on this very program mm -hmm. and really fitting into that ethos. Mike Bassick, ladies and gentlemen. It's it's just like wait why why are you doing that? Mm -hmm. He didn't put his hand in his pants. He just like and you're just like I think he's loose down yeah. there. It's you Michael Parsons. About if he was wearing yes. underwear, he wasn't. He was wearing like he was wearing. Do you know how many people messaged me to tell me they went back and watched it and they believe he <laughs> is watching underwear and that's your fault. He is wa wearing underwear. Yes, and that's your fault. The Mike Bassick fascination with underwear over the last Whoa. couple months has been. I Incredible. think he had a lot of dangle down there, <laughs> sure. and he had to hold it while he was walking, and then he probably threw, and things got, you know, Are you proud slapped of him? upon. Are you proud of him for having that much dangle? I don't know if I'm proud of him. He oh. didn't cause that. Sure, it's that's not, it's not like point. he worked out hard to get a dangle. He just didn't wear underwear. <laughs> that's or how if you have a big happens. thing, like, you didn't do anything, it's just... That's what God gave you. Do your well. Never mind. Just keep going. Just keep going. That was gonna give me. Like, how do you follow that up, right? I, I get well. And in, in in that vein, Kevin, you said this. Corey showing it off. Mike showing it off. What I've got in my hand right here. Well, that. Yeah. What was that about? That was about. I think at the card show. But it sounds like... What does it sound like, Kevin? An old-fashioned... Um, well, you know. Text in if you know what I would have said. But yeah, that sounds bad. That's bad. That's bad. I think that's the theme of this segment Crap. today. And honestly, a lot of the time. Um, back to Mike Bassett. Me I get it. Human. You said throwing from the car. I bet his seatbelt wasn't on. You yeah. don't have to keep putting yeah. it right into me right now. At, what? <laughs> what? I don't know. The hell did you just say? It was a sentence I regret. <laughs> <laughs> okay? We have to move on. Do we? Now, that was in regards to that commercial that we play. They're like, hey, your son died. Also, he wasn't wearing his seatbelt. And they're yeah. like, you tickets. should feel bad about that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I just had a sentence that went the wrong way. Like, you don't have to put it on me right now mm -hmm. instead of in me. Mm -hmm. And that's what I meant. But mm -hmm. I said the wrong word. I changed an O to an I. Mm -hmm. It ended up being a bad sentence. You guys called me out for it. And it happened. Right now, I'm probably voting for that. Yes, that is probably what I'm going to vote that's for. That's a leader too. in the clubhouse that right now. That's pretty incredible. Let's see if it can be beat. Kevin, would you like to give it a shot? <laughs> I'm yeah. sorry. I'll start flashing them to the camera. Damn it. That card show is going to be the ruin. <laughs> that card show is going to be my ruin. Crap. What were you flashing on the camera? Hopefully sports collectibles, or else why am I still on the air? Oh, that was it. Okay. Um. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for laying out on that part. Yeah, collaborative effort by the two gentlemen on the program this Friday, Kevin and Mike. Trevor Lawrence, number one on the list. Please, baby, please. <laughs> I feel like that's a mic one more than it is me. Why was that so I, just, sexual? I said a no <laughs> That's from that is from a 90s song, and I'm trying to think in my head, what is that from? Is that from a um um what are those guys called? The Voice uh, to Men? Voice to Men. Oh my you. God! Yeah! Okay. yeah! Come on! Isn't that a Voice to How Men? How about that? Isn't that a Voice to Men? I have like, no idea, but the, I'm just glad I guessed that. Like the End of the Road song or something? They they start doing that? I am excited that I got that The guy that with the right. deep voice. I don't know all their names. The guy with the deep voice starts just talking uh -huh. to the lady. Please, baby, please. <laughs> all the way home. <laughs> You know what I'm talking about, right? Guys? <laughs> I can't believe you stopped. <laughs> to the end of the road. Mike's going to be fascinated with this one. Kevin said this.
Rashad Bateman. I've been now, trying to tell y'all. This is somebody that I would love to blow up. <laughs> you said it that way. Not like him to blow up as a player oh and be a great God. player. You wanted to blow him up yourself. <laughs> Man. As feel, as like as he's a he balloon. Was, yeah, exactly. And speaking of. Oh, thank God. We had an incredible <laughs> conversation about balloons. The helium is being sent to Europe right now because of the war Ow. in Russia and Ow. Ukraine. Are we sending balloons over there? No, but they're canisters, Kevin. How do you think? I don't know. See that helium why canister. Is it, why doesn't a helium canister float away? It does, because canister. it's heavier. Than, it, helium is too light. Helium is lighter than air. It's light. <laughs> yeah, that's the, true. The canister keeps, that. yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't know about the helium in our Earth that like it's floating because of it, but it might be. <laughs> and right. if it is and we that run is out not, of it, we're just going to sink. not sing. right. Oh my god. Oh, that is a strong contender as well. Man, a lot of balloon and helium talk on the show this week. I wanted to vote for how much you love Nate Burleson, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Wait, when did Nate Burleson get into this? Bur no, this is Sean Payman. I don't know. <laughs> Close what, enough. What else, Reggie? Wasn't he a receiver? <laughs> yes, Nate Burleson was how a receiver. How do you lump people together? Largely for the Detroit Lions, I believe. Yeah, he was a receiver. The same thing. <laughs> They're the same person. They both are average at best. <laughs> wow. Oh, Rashad Bateman's only played a season. Yeah. Mike's already <laughs> slotted yeah. him. Guess and what? he'll never be any yeah. better than that. I, I will bet you he will never be any better than an average receiver. You know what? I have just become invested in the success of Rashad Bateman. <laughs> You're like, in your face, I'm Mike. I'm the next Nate Burleson. Well, hey, if he ends up on Good Morning America, I think he'll take it. All right, what else? What do you mean, what else? Vote. Give me one more. No. Okay, I guess. I yes! guess I can do that for you. No! Stop using helium for balloons. <laughs> I told you. So true. It ticks me off. I saw helium in balloons the other day. Stop doing it. Did we you need confront it. confront them? No, I should You have. should. Yeah. I like, Jack. I think it was <laughs> oh maybe God. on, I might have been on Instagram and stuff. People are graduating and doing things and they're using helium for no reason. Uh -huh. You don't need helium in balloons. It is a resource <laughs> that we are wasting away. And when we don't have helium, we're not going to have MRI machines. Uh -huh. We're not going to have medicine. We're not going to have a <laughs> lot of things. That's right. Any medicine? That's right, Kevin. No right. medicine because of the helium. Our earth is not making it fast enough and we're <laughs> out of it and stop using it in balloons. Please. I I am still, despite all the balloon talk, I'm still going to vote for Mike's slip up about what he thought about the seatbelt commercial. Me I get it. You said throwing from the car. I bet his seatbelt wasn't on. You yeah. don't have to keep putting yeah. it into me right now. I Oops. All right. That's a strong contender. I won't vote for your Nate Burleson, Rashad Bateman. <laughs> Topic. Man, Nate Burleson did nothing to catch these strays. Helium. Same with Shane Larkin. I'm voting for helium. Okay. We need to know more. <laughs> <laughs> is this about the canisters with me and Corey? Yeah, I think so. Okay. The helium is being sent to Europe right now because of the war Ow. in Russia and Ow. Ukraine. Are we sending balloons over there? No, but they're canisters, Kevin. How do you think? I don't know. Is a helium why canister? Is it, why is it? it just keeps going. All right. It's like when he said it's lighter than air, and I'm like, that's a fact. Yeah. It is true. It is lighter than air. Reggie, what are you voting for? Uh, I'm voting for apparently y'all having a good time at the uh, Dallas Car Show. Corey's showing it off. Mike's showing it off. What I've got in my hand right here. That's not good.